Well, a new robot at St. Vincent Healthcare has helped a man battling severe pain and discomfort finally enjoy the things he loves again. Q2 Shaquille Cozart caught up with him less than a month after surgery. Tuesday afternoon, Christopher Smith came to St. Vincent Healthcare's Regional Neuroscience Center, accompanied by his mother, for a checkup after a surgery that's not too common in Montana, especially when performed by a robot. Christopher, now 30 years old, was born premature along with his twin brother, Matthew. Christopher weighed one pound 15 ounces and Matthew weighed one pound 14 ounces. For Christopher, being premature at birth came with some medical complications. He was diagnosed with cerebral palsy, which ultimately led to scoliosis. He couldn't hold his head up. His head was always, you know, down here, his chin and his chest. And, um... He was getting pneumonia all the time because the scoliosis was collapsing one of his lungs. When he was 10, rods and wires were placed in his back from the base of his tailbone to his neck. So now he could sit up straight and tall. But two years ago, things started to change. He was irritable, didn't want to move in certain ways. You could tell he was just in pain of some sorts. After seeing multiple specialists, Vicky found out that one of the rods holding Christopher's back in place had broken. That's when they were referred to Dr. Lina of St. Vincent Healthcare, who would use a robot to perform a surgery which would stabilize the broken rod and prevent Christopher's discomfort. These surgeries can be long. They can be eight, nine, 10 hours. And if you have the robot taking a lot of the stress off of your shoulders, then you're much fresher for the more intricate places, parts of the case. And when you have the robot helping with those more complex cases, I, it's just a great valuable tool. The surgery took place in early April, and Vicki says that Christopher's improvement was almost immediate. Within the first two days, Christopher's back pain was completely gone. Now, without the constant pain, Christopher is looking forward to what he loves doing the most. We got amazing opportunities now to get him up on his feet, back to activities he used to love to do. Reporting in Billings, I'm Shaquille Cozart with MTN News. All right, thanks so much, Shaq. Now, Dr. Linus says this technology has been introduced to St. Vincent in the past six months. For more information, visit KTVQ.com.